Oh man, man oh man. You know, before I start this video, look at Dana White. Like, this guy, I've never seen a guy with a ball head like this. Like, this man got, he look like a, a damn ball headed rhinoceros. Like, he just looks like a ball headed rhinoceros. I mean, I guess that's okay for a guy that, that slapped his wife, and I know some of y'all don't want to hear that. But this man slapped his wife in front of the world and got a pass. I still can't believe that to this day. To this day! I can't believe that. This man slapped his wife and got a pass. Oh, well, let's talk about this fight. Okay, folks, listen. Whether you like Kobe Covington or you, you, you hate him, I can't stand this guy. I can't stand him with a passion. But I must be balanced. Kobe Covington is a very bad matchup for Leon Edwards. Very bad. Um, Kobe isn't going to be stupid enough to try to trade with this guy. He, Kobe ain't that dumb, okay? Kobe is going to get close. And he's going to try to drag this fight to the ground. And this is what I know that he's going to try to do. First of all, Leon Edwards got a range advantage. If we really want to talk stand-up, Kobe Covington don't have great range, okay? Um, his kicks are average. His jabs are average. Kobe Covington beats people on volume and volume alone. Um, while you're trying to take a break, he's still coming at you, okay? While you're trying to figure out what you got to do next, Kobe Covington don't allow you time to just sit and think because he's coming at you he's not going to let you sit back and reset and try to get your kicks off he, he's not doing that Kobe Covington is going to be in your face for 25 minutes if you let him he's going to be right there he's not moving he's not going on look this man is going to be in your face until the fight's over until the referee says okay fight's over this is a bad matchup for Leon Edwards um Kobe Covington, on the other hand, though, Kamaru Usman is a script tonight. See, Kobe can't deal with Kamaru Usman because Usman isn't afraid to go to the ground. And he's not going to panic if he get taken down. See, I watched Leon Edwards get taken down by Usman. I watched it. And you know what? He didn't have a response to it. He didn't really have a real response. And that was concerning because I want Leon Rocky Edwards to knock out Kobe. I mean, we all do. But I also have to look at this as a pugilist, a person that watch fights all the time and, and understand what I'm watching. And Kobe Covington, I hate to say it, but he'll he'll have a much easier time versus Leon, and he'll have a very difficult time versus uh, Kamaru. Although it's MMA, anything can happen. But I think Kobe Covington is going to win this fight. Um, it's because of how the styles match up. It's because of how it match up. Kobe's fast, and he he's that guy that's, that's getting in your face. And he's going to try to maul you. His stand-up and strikes are not great. Kobe Covington don't have great striking, but it's effective. And he'll throw a bunch of jabs and throw a lot of low kicks. He'll try to throw an ugly-looking head kick every now and then. Okay, he'll try to do all that, but that's just to provide interruption, interference. So he can take you to the ground. That's that's what he does. And he's going to do that to Leon Edwards. Leon Edwards might be completely confuzzled. Okay? Kobe doesn't give you a lot of time to make mistakes. You make a mistake against this guy, you're going to be on the canvas. He's going to have you on the ground, and he's just going to beat you down and maul you to death. That's the fighting style that he possesses. That's what he does. But see, what was Usman able to do? Early on in a fight, you know, Kobe got close to Usman. And when Kobe realized, damn, Kamaru Usman is extremely strong, he abandoned that idea of trying to take him to the ground. Like Kobe did in their first fight, he abandoned it. He abandoned that idea because he knew locking up with Usman wasn't going to work. Usman was too strong. And Kobe felt it. So Kobe backed up and tried another strategy, which I can't blame him for that. Can't hate on it because you're a fighter. You know, you, you have to come up with different ways to win the fight but 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 if Kobe can't take Leon Edwards to the ground he's gonna get knocked out the more the longer that Kobe Covington remains standing 
the more likelihood he's going to get himself knocked out. And that's just what it is. That's just what it is. It, it, it is what it is. The longer he stands, the more likelihood that he's going to get put to sleep. Um, and Leon Edwards is the guy that he can do it. Leon Edwards can put Kobe Covington <laughs> under the ground. It's going to be an entertaining fight for as long as it lasts. It really is. Um, this won't be a boring fight. You know, these two have been going back and forth, trading a lot of barbs. Um, I think Leon Edwards, he, his takedown defense is going to have to be on point. Because any mistake in not defending these takedowns, and that belt is going to change hands faster than sooner. Or it's going to faster than later. Sorry about that. 